first day is going to be it's going to be such a challenge. Um, you know, I would definitely argue that this year it's going to be the toughest and best year competitively from the women's side um, from that standpoint. I mean, I really believe that there's probably, you know, if there's 40 women racing, there's probably, I think, 35, maybe even 40 women that, if they have a great day, could finish in the top 10. So it just means that everybody's going to be, you know, it's going to be a great race. Um, you know, for me, I'm a, I'm a slower swimmer, so I'm going to come out further back. So, you know, for me, the goal on the swim is to minimize the damage. Um, and the goal I've sort of set for myself throughout the season and um, what I'm going to be really looking to do, you know, in Kona is to try to um, limit it to under 10 minutes coming out of the water, which is a big gap, but that's, you know, that's where I am and that's what my goal is. And then, um, you know, getting on the bike and I really need to execute a strong bike and be really tactical about it be strong but then able to get off and run because I think that the people who are able to run close to three hours are going to be the ones that are seeing themselves finishing in the top ten so um, you know I've been running really well I feel really really good about um, how my running has been going it's kind of surprised me a little bit I'm in the kind of like a little bit of that panic mode where I'm afraid to lose it um, so I'm really excited to get out there and see how it goes. I think it's going to be back and forth all day. You know, I think you're going to see the usual suspects out of the water first, and there are some really, really strong bike riders on there, but there are a bunch of girls who are not as fast on the swim who have incredible bike rides. There are a bunch of people who are strong swimmers, not as strong on the bike, amazing runners. So I think you're just going to see a lot of movement throughout the day and a lot of position changes, and I think People are going to really put themselves out there and you're going to see some phenomenal races and you're going to see a lot of really amazing athletes probably blow up a little bit too, but that's what you have to do at the World Championships. You've got to just put it all on the line and hope that it, uh, it works out.